How's it going guys? Uh, TBlackjacks1 here to give you the generic excuse to as why I haven't been um, making videos lately. Um, also a Moonrise Kingdom uh, review and some other shit. So stay tuned to the end of the video. Um, so yeah, my excuse for um, not being here is uh, finals, obviously. Um, you know, I you know that's the excuse everyone gives at the end of the year, but you know, it's a good excuse. Um, you know, unfortunately I'm still in school because my school fucking sucks, but um, yeah, I, I, I can be making videos because I don't have to suck. So yeah, Moonrise Kingdom is the new Wes Anderson movie. The, um, Wes Anderson, the director that indie, um, you know, people worship as a god. Um, yeah, this may surprise you, but I, I'm really not familiar with a a Wes Anderson's work. I've only seen, like, Fantastic Mr. Fox. I have not seen Rushmore. So basically the story is about, um, two, like, 12-year-old-ish, uh, kids who, um, a girl and a boy who um, meet once and they plan to run away from their um, you know homes because their uh, family like environment is you know very unhealthy and sucks and so they plan to you know run away meet up together and have this love relationship together this movie also co-stars um, Edward Norton uh, Bruce Willis Bill Murray Francis McDormand and all four of those people are fantastic in their roles so uh, what yeah what did I think of Moonrise Kingdom um, I loved it I said Wes Anderson does really use his, you know, type of direction to full effect here. I don't know how to do anything not Wes Anderson style. And, um, you know, I can understand how uh, that can maybe get on the nerves of some people. I really liked it. I thought, um, you know, the cinematography was very engaging. Although, uh, you know, people don't really act this way um, in real life. Uh, I, I thought, the, you know, the dialogue, the, the, sc the screenplay was, you know, very, very good. And um, the dialogue was very engaging. I mean, you know, it's a love relationship between, like, two 12-year-olds, and, um, sometimes it can get, uh, pretty awkward, um, especially this, you know, this one scene where they're, like, you know, touching each other, and, uh, you know, it's, like, you know, kind of weird to be in that theater. The movie is, you know, very, very entertaining. It, it, it never keeps you bored. Um, I thought the editing, even though, like, you know, for the first, like, half an hour or 20 minutes or something, you might be, like, kind of confused once you start getting it, um... You know, it's it, it never gets boring and it it stays very consistent and you're always really engaged um, in this movie and you know like I said the adult actors I'd say especially Bill Murray are really really good. Um, the final act I although strange at times I loved. I thought the final act was really really great. It's very uh, refreshing for Wes Anderson to do you know a kind of movie like this with all the generic movies coming out lately. Um, I really appreciated his style. As for flaws, I'd say um. Sometimes, like, especially with the kids, a lot of this, you know, the movie, I know it's kind of the point, but a lot of the movie just kind of felt too scripted, and, uh, you know, like, the kids, you know, when, when, a lot of times when the kids were talking with each other, I'm like, you know, kids never act like this. I thought some of, you know, sometimes they're, t they're saying, just um, saying their lines back and forth to, um, you know, too fast, and, you know, I, they could have done a little bit better. Um, so I'm going to give this a movie a 9 out of 10. And uh, to finish the video, um... I don't know if you know this or not, but uh, they're filming Grown Ups 2, and they are filming Grown Ups 2 uh, five minutes away from me. Um, they're probably filming it right this very second, five minutes away from me. It's in my hometown, and, um, you know, when I see the movie, I I'm not saying, like, you know, I'm, I'm going to recognize a lot of places. I'm saying that I'm going to recognize every frame of this movie, um, because they're filming all around my hometown, and I'm going to be watching my childhood on screen. And that's going to be really cool. I already got I already got um, some footage of some of the sets. Um, I might try to I, I I'm trying to upload it, but you know my phone's being all wacky. And um, but uh, later today I'm going to go visit the set and watch them filming. Hopefully get some footage. Hopefully be able to put it up on YouTube. Hopefully get an autograph. So uh, yeah. Anyway, Moonrise Kingdom nine out of ten. I'm T Black X One and go fuck yourself.